And now, News Channel 10's 24-7 local weather first alert forecast, sponsored by Generator Supercenter of Amarillo. Well, good Monday morning, everyone kicking off a brand new work week. And unfortunately, the news is not great when it comes to looking at rain chances and a hopeful eventual cool down. As you'll see here, looking at a regional satellite radar, you can actually trace the rain as it go goes up and over our area. And well, that looks a little bit like a dome. That's because we are under a heat dome. We've got a big high pressure system right over the top of us, unfortunately keeping those rain chances out. But one thing it is allowing for is heat advisories. Unfortunately, all you see is these counties, central, southeastern parts of the area that does include, as you can see right there, Paladero Canyon. Temperatures can be expected today upwards of 105 to 109 degrees at their absolute hottest. And all of those heat advisories in effect until sundown tonight. So unfortunately, we are looking at prolonged heat. And well, that's our next weather maker. I wish the news was better, but we are kind of in these dog days of summer right now. That's just keeping us hot and mostly dry. So let's take a look at our general setup here. So as you can see right now, high pressure keeping that jet stream up and over our area. Unfortunately, not even remotely close to our part of the region. And so with that will come a lot of heat out there, 100 plus degrees here nearly every single day this week. And as we just saw right there, that monsoon moisture is being swept up and over our region, unfortunately leaving little to no chances of rain. There might be some small chances in the northwest, but really for the most part, we're looking at very dry and very hot conditions out there. So looking at your temperature forecast for today, starting out this morning in the upper 70s, we're going to be in the 90s before lunchtime today. So really a pretty quick warmth. You're going to see maybe some slightly cooler temperatures there up in the north, but high 70s still as you go into the early afternoon. 103 for your high today here in Amarillo. You're going to see places like Childress there at 106, but you'll see generally kind of this shape right here that's kind of following along this region right here. That's where those temperatures are just a little bit hotter. 103, 101, you'll see 98 in Portales, 97 in Tucumcari, 91 up in Elkhart and Liberal. We're going to have to wait until probably 9, 10 o'clock tonight to actually see those temperatures drop down below the 90s. Winds-wise, not really getting much of help here as we're seeing those winds out of the west-southwest to start out the day 5 to 15 miles an hour. As we head into the middle to late afternoon, those winds start to turn a little more southeasterly. Pretty much business as usual on that front. So, of course, we want to remind you of our heat safety checklist because we want you to have that first alert weather app. That'll let you know your current conditions, how hot it really is outside. Of course, drink lots of fluids, stay cool, take breaks in the air conditioning, shade, things like that. Looking at your seven-day supercast here, maybe a 10% chance of rain up in the northwest tomorrow, but really, for the most part, we're not looking at any rain chances returning until hopefully this pattern starts to break up maybe by late week and early week next week. That's what we're hoping for, maybe a little bit of an eventual pattern shift there, give us a little bit of relief from that heat, but you do see up until then, temperatures are just unfortunately looking very hot. So stay cool out there, keep it locked to the News Channel 10 for the latest on your local forecast.